this happened uh, we sat across the table and they said, you know, they think you're, they, they think you're uh, crazy, but after what I say, you're going to look like a moderate. That's right. That's right. <laughs> Kevin and Matt. What, uh, what I didn't make a big deal of. But the Torin system relies on um, accurate government surveys. The Torin system was actually implemented formally, formally implemented on June the 9th, 1862, the exact same time that Poole was introducing smallpox on the Valley Pool. It'd be good to explain what Torrens is. Well, I mean, this is the whole. I mean, this is a whole legal lecture yeah. about the Torrens system. <laughs> but at that same time, Douglas writes a note, and he says that all basically what he says here is that all the native reserves that we need have already been, have already been created, and because there's a few, and they allow a budget. They allow a budget of about a hundred dollars. Uh, to lay out all the rest of the reserves uh, throughout, the, throughout the province from uh, June 62. The budget is supposed to go to the end of August 62, and by then all of the native reserves that we ever need will all be created. That's the implication of this letter. I mean, these are fantasies um, that they're that they're created. But the Torrance system is implemented on the ground on the same day the smallpox begins. It's interesting that you know that uh, Canada passed this rule that uh, Native people couldn't consult lawyers. And, you'll, and if you notice my presentation, I, how often I refer to the preemption records, the actual records. And I am convinced that one of the reasons they put that rule in was so the Native community couldn't go and hire lawyers. And because what do lawyers do? They start doing title searches. And they would have discovered by following just the way I did that the actual people who claimed the land of these places had introduced smallpox there. Um, if, the, if the native people had been allowed to hire lawyers, that's what the lawyers would have discovered. And they would have discovered this 100 years ago. They would have discovered it 100 years ago. Something else you talked about the other night when you did this presentation, and I'm wondering if you could expand on it here. Was uh, we talked about this at one point in the hot match, and you touched on it here tonight about the uh, you know keeping native people in a place where they couldn't uh, recover from the genocide. Yes, that's, yeah, that's what the that's what the policies afterward policies are. That's why they're called no reserves. That's why they put in this policy that they just can't plan land. Is this denying them the resources that they need to recover? And what I think I had said that the, that uh, there are studies. Of other places where there have been smallpox in the, like in the Pacific, where the population normally comes in about two generations. You know, that's what that's what normally happens. Uh, because uh, when people die, there all of a sudden there's all a whole bunch of available resources. So then people have children, uh, and they go in the, to take advantage of those unused resources. Uh, because if, there, if you all of a sudden get a whole bunch of resources, you can have more children. And so that's the effect. In fact, in the Chicago, you can see this uh, in the family of the warrior, where um, he had taken a second wife and he had two young children. This happens after the smallpox in the 40s hung. And his teenage son uh, had been married and had children. So all these people, are, they're generating children right away. And that's a natural uh, result. But then what happens is that they're denied the, you know, the settlers come along and they preempt the most valuable places. Uh, and they native people get driven off uh, into less uh, less amenable areas uh, for these uh, free and available resources, and so they're denied the resources that they need to recover. Uh, that's uh, and that's part of this uh, part of the effect of this uh, program. Uh, 